Hello everybody, it's Taco from Alexanote here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to troubleshoot lag in your Minecraft server. There are three different types of lag, which I'll be going over in this video. There's ping lag, which is your network caused by your server or client. TPS, which is your ticks per second, or server lag caused by the server, and frames per second lag caused by your client. Here's a simple way to distinguish the difference between the different types of lag so you can scroll to the appropriate section in the video. Ping lag is if your bars inside the tab is less than 4 or 5. TPS lag is if your TPS is below 18 to 20. You can check this by typing slash TPS. FPS lag is if your FPS is below 40 to 60 and your screen is continuously freezing or crashing as a result. You can check this by clicking F3 and it's in the top left. Ping is calculated in milliseconds. This is your network connection which is between your router and the server. Your location is the most impacting factor when it comes to ping, but your router and provider are also really important. If everyone is having ping lag on the server, this would indicate that the host network is at fault. You may need to contact us to investigate this. You can check your ping to a server without actually joining the server. To do this, you'll need to open the command prompt or the equivalent depending on your operating system and just type in ping and then the server IP. I'm going to use hypixel.net as the example here. This will return a millisecond value. By default, Minecraft only shows bars in game and on the server list. Although in the server list, you can hover over the bars to see the exact milliseconds. Keep in mind that this table will help you differentiate whether what type of lag you have. TPS stands for ticks per second and is calculated in a range of 1 to 20. You can see your server's TPS by using the slash TPS command or you can type TPS into the console. If this doesn't work, you'll need to install Spigot or Paper. You may use 20 TPS and still experience some lag on your server. A very good way of improving TPS is using the recommendations we provide when you paste your timings report in our Discord server in the bot commands. This should be your first step. Ensure you are using PaperMC as your server version in order to do this. This is what the recommendation will look like. Another reason your server may be lagging is because it is out of resources. One of the most common sources of lag, especially for the newest versions of Minecraft, is RAM. This is single-handedly the most important factor when it comes to resourcing your Minecraft server, although this does not mean that CPU and storage are not as important. On our game panel, you can view your resource usage on the tab next to your console. Don't worry about your CPU usage as much. Generally with the way Minecraft servers work, with a single thread requirement, CPU usage is not much to be worried about even as it normally peaks here and there. But for RAM, if you are running out of RAM or storage, your server will have lots of issues, including server lag. If you are running out of RAM, ensure to upgrade your server and meet our general RAM recommendations for servers. FPS stands for frames per second, and whilst it may sometimes be caused by the server, it is generally classified as a client side lag. Therefore, you can bet that most of the time you suffer from FPS lag is due to your own device. In the rare chance it is due to the server, there is never classified as a host issue, but rather from activities within the server itself. This can include things from blowing lots of TNT or players, creating lag machines that not only target TPS degradation, but also FPS decreases. FPS lag comes in the form of your Minecraft server session freezing up or freezing all around. You can keep track of your FPS by clicking F1. If you're confident that there is no lag machines or large CND bombings on your server, especially if it is a wild listed server for example, then it is safe to go on to start optimizing your client side. Make sure you have Optifine installed as it will make your game run much more smoothly. Secondly, if you have the money, start upgrading your device or PC or purchasing a better one, focusing mainly on the CPU to increase FPS. Thirdly, Sometimes you just need to restart your game or device. There are also many other general tips in this regard that can optimize your device. Hopefully we fix the lag in your Minecraft server. If not, feel free to create a ticket and we can try to have you out there. That's all for me today. Goodbye.